so today I'm going to show you how to make resin coasters and a resin ashtray. This is a super duper easy DIY. For this project you'll need cups to measure your resin, a mixing bowl, resin additives such as glitter, pigments, or alcohol inks depending on what type of coaster or ashtray you want to make. You'll need popsicle sticks to mix, mix and a mini torch is really good to have to pop the resin bubbles. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. Now let's jump to it. Okay, so this is the mold that I'm using. I purchased it from Amazon and I will have the link for you guys. This is part A of my resin and this is part B. I normally add part A first. It just mixes easier to me when you add the thicker um, part of the resin. And I'm using eight ounces today because I'm also making coasters, but the actual ashtray uses about six ounces of resin, which is still a lot. So that's the first two ounces of part A that I'm adding right there. So I'm not gonna spend a lot of time showing you guys how I mix it because you can actually see how I mix um, my resin in my tumbler video I showed how I actually mix it but um, basically you just mix the first part with the second part in equal parts equal volume and you mix it until it is clear um, that's usually about five minutes if I'm mixing smaller batches but if I'm mixing a larger batch like I am today it took me about seven minutes for it to get clear and the faster that you go the more air bubbles you're going to create that's definitely something to remember when mixing your resin and once I've mixed it I go ahead and add any additives that I need to add Now that I have my resin mixed up, I'm going to add my alcohol ink. And this is the glitter that I'm using. It's like an orange pinkish color. So I'm going to add um, quite a few drops of alcohol ink because remember I'm using eight ounces of resin. And I want to make sure that it has a really nice orange color. But it's still going to be translucent that's why I'm using alcohol inks instead of like like you could even use paint um, acrylic paint just a few drops of acrylic paint if you want an opaque color but I want mine to still be translucent so mix that up and now I'm going to add the glitter And it's up to you really how much you add. Add a little bit at a time because if you add too much, it'll be really chunky and it won't cure right. And once you get the glitter and the alcohol ink mixed really well, you're gonna go ahead and pour it into your mold and make sure that your mold is on a flat surface. If it's not on a flat surface, it will be, the, the bottom of it will be uneven and you don't want that. See, it's really, really easy to create, um, especially if you've previously worked with resin. The hardest part is mixing it up, and that's not even too hard. Also, remember, resin is heat resistant, but I would not suggest like ashing out any lit cigarettes like directly in the ashtray. I would actually like you can let it burn out, but I would not like press down um, a lit cigarette butt into the ashtray. Um, I think that it would probably discol discolor it and eventually it would start to ruin the surface of your project. 
just a little heads up. So the only thing left to do is remove the pieces that you just made from your molds. And that's it. This was a really cool project to do. And if you guys enjoyed this video, go ahead and hit that like button. Go ahead and subscribe and check out my other videos.